if you have been following me on youtube or binance or my instagram page i always talk about fundamental analysis today is a perfect day for me to explain fundamental analysis because today is 4th january first friday of the new year that's 2024 if you are new to my channel my name is askanda and i trade and i also teach people how to trade crypto only crypto day trading so if you are interested in that or if you want to change your financial situation through that make sure you subscribe to my channel and also share this video hit the like button and at the end if you have any questions for me i'm always ready to help you you can just leave it in the comment section or you can click the first link join the telegram group and text me on whatsapp so what we want to do is this is a website that we are going to be using called investing.com i will advise you to pay close attention to what i'm about to show you because some people will never teach you this before you enter a trade ask yourself is bitcoin moving up or moving down and this is what happens bitcoin is pegged with the dollar btc is the base currency and dollar is pegged with it so bitcoin controls 70 percent of the altcoin movement in a day that bitcoin is moving up just know that ethereum will start to move and the altcoins will follow we have dydx we have ftm we have solana ada we have run we have all these render token all of them will start to follow so if bitcoin is rising it's just a matter of hours or minutes and you see the altcoins will follow and if bitcoin is falling the altcoins will also start to dump they will also start to fall they will even fall drastically and if bitcoin is in the range market if bitcoin is neither moving up nor moving down remember the altcoins will dump the altcoins will fall so before you take a trade ask yourself this question today is bitcoin rising or is bitcoin falling then you go ahead and take the trade but the next catch is the next part before you take a trade to is first thing is check to see whether bitcoin is rising or falling because we are crypto traders and bitcoin controls 70 percent of the direction of the market so we check for bitcoin when we check for bitcoin now we need to use a website called investing.com they have an app for android phone and also for iphones so just go to your apple store so for me i am using an iphone if you are using an android phone just go to your google play store and you search for investing.com search for investing.com you just search for it you see this is the app make sure you download investing.com this is the right app the app you are supposed to download so once you have this app downloaded now the next thing that we want to do is we want to open the app then do the settings so if you download the app and you open it this is what it's going to look like right make sure you go and click on the more section when you click on the more section we have cryptocurrencies we have calendars we have pre trending stocks and pre-market analysis what i want you to focus on is the calendar okay so i have customized it to be this way i'll explain these things for you to understand so that you can use it to determine the direction of the market right so we click on the final button at the top right hand side then we can turn on the filters so we have the filters turn it on then you go for default when you go for default now you select high okay so with the countries click on the custom okay so you make sure you antique all these countries leaving only united states germany and united kingdom you are going to leave only three countries that's the three major sessions you are going to leave germany you are going to leave uh great britain so you can see the logo of great britain here the british pound then we can also see the euro zone here the euro then we have the united states dollar when you observe and watch closely you can see three hairs attached to this so this was a news coming from the great britain that was around 9 30 a.m in the morning 
then we have this news that's the non-form payroll it was around 1 30 pm in the afternoon time so when we click on this okay they are going to explain this for us so i'm going to use this and explain it for you to see so no farm payrolls measures the change in the number of people employed during the previous month so in december if many people were employed that means that the us dollar is currently high and if the us dollar is strong chances are bitcoin will fall so you can see that the previous was 178 and now the actual is 216 which means that the us dollar is currently bullish and if us dollar is rising bitcoin will fall for us to use this and set example i want you to observe something okay this was yesterday on trading view okay so we took a sell because we knew the market was going to dump we took a sell on uh pp 1000 pp and it really got to our first tp so what i'll do is i'll just search for btc here okay so let's search for btc it's time for prayers so i have to go for prayers so if we search for btc here then we type in btc.p if you want to use trading view to calculate your position size go and watch my other video so you just click on btc here you can see during that time look at what happened btc was around forty four thousand two hundred and sixty dollars and it dumped to forty three thousand two hundred because when the news was released people were actually projecting that the dollar will be strong and when the news was released the dollar was stronger than bitcoin so because of that bitcoin fell when you want to know the direction of the market just look at either the actual is more than the previous if the actual is more than the previous then that means the dollar will rise and if dollar is rising bitcoin will be falling and if bitcoin is rising the dollar will be falling so always ask yourself in our current economic situations is the dollar strong or weak so immediately if the dollar is strong then just know that the this thing will also be weak bitcoin will be weak for us to use this and confirm i want you to check gold so let's search for xau xau usd okay so we search for xau usd we'll click on olanda here this was today's news so during the news release we saw a spike of gold then it quickly dumped again because the dollar was strong and gold is the base currency so the base currency will fall if us dollar is rising and bitcoin is the base currency so this is how you use the news to predict the market the same thing with all these things so if you just come and click on the more section they are going to tell you how it affect the current situation the current market so starting from monday to friday dollar will be strong that means bitcoin will be in a downtrend as a time of making this video so if you want to predict into the future how the currencies will behave particularly bitcoin if bitcoin is rising the outcoins will rise and if bitcoin is falling the outcoins will fall and also if there is a chance that the new york dollar is strong bitcoin will surely be in a downtrend so you can even see this for example when we go to uh trading view so let's go to trading view for instance and we search for btc so you can see like bitcoin is now in a downtrend because the news was released always add p to your search so we add p to it we could see like bitcoin is now forming a downtrend bitcoin is now forming a downtrend you can see bitcoin is now forming a downtrend because the us dollar is strong investors will go and invest in the us dollar pushing the value of the dollar up now bitcoin is opposite of dollar so if bitcoin is falling the dollar will rise and if dollar is rising bitcoin will fall so now that we know that oh the fundamentals usually affect the market any day that you are going to trade please go to your investing.com and click on your economic calendar so when you click on the economic calendar section here 
they will tell you that day the news that are coming on so if news is coming from the united states make sure you click on the news and try to understand okay what is this news talking about if the news is good for the dollar then it's bad for bitcoin and cryptocurrencies anything that is good for dollar is bad for cryptocurrencies remember this before you start trading always ask yourself if the news is good for the dollar is bad for uh, this thing cryptocurrencies i'm going for prayers make sure you subscribe in the next video i'm going to show you how to do sentimental analysis see you in the next